only thing I have left to guide me. We're almost at the end. Oh, fuck. It's so ends. We are back with an another reaction to episode. <sighs> Welcome back. Oh, no, no, no. One episode away from the last. Welcome back, everybody, to another Madoka Magica reaction. We are on episode 11. We only have one episode left before we're done with this show. I have enjoyed the show so far a lot more than I expected, actually. And, um, yeah, this, sh this episode is called The Only Thing I Have Left to Guide Me. Let's jump straight into it. Time Traveler. Yeah, I've, I've always wondered how many times exactly has she traveled. One great mission. Why is her potential shot so big? Oh, he has a theory. Tell us. Kamarik Destiny. Ooh. Oh. Could it be her pro? I mean, QB is figuring out more, a lot more things than it should be. Oh. Oh shoot, if they all come together, oh that would be bad, that would be really bad, it would be even more powerful than normal. So she's just making the situation worse. Oh everything's just gonna turn back against her? Nah man. We can't have that. We can't have that. And also, the opening, I just want to mention, every time when I watch the opening, it gets more and more sad. I, I just, I can't handle it anymore. Like, it, it used to be so beautiful. It used to be so cheery. What got me into this show, it, it was a perfect magical girl opening, and now it's just... Even this opening is filled with darkness now. It's just it's just foretelling me like it's basically telling me the whole entire story. This opening is literally telling me the whole entire story, and it, it's sad because it, it's literally uh, talking about the time travel and all the promises and everything about Madoka and and, and Haruna. Oh, man, I'm butchering their names. I hate that. All right. Um. Yeah, let's let, let's just jump into it. Oh, they're holding a funeral for her. I thought they would just forget about her or something. Oh, that was they kind of just like pass it on like nothing happened. Man, this is sad. She can't tell anybody. Is there mountain catching on? Oh, 
Ah, uh, he's treating them like livestock. Go vegan! Yeah, I mean, I, I can see where QB is coming from. I, I can see where he's coming from. It's uh, it's just, just facts and reality, right? Oh my god. This show is really good at slapping people in the face about the word reality. Oh man. Isn't that a witch's power right there? Oh. Okay. Okay. That is kind of sad. Oh. So, 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 so the more they wish to change, the more it'll come back and bite them. So he's basically God. My God. Is QB like? A godlike figure of something? Like, is there anything above QB? So he keeps saying we, as in there's more than just one QB, like, like like not as him having multiple copies of himself, like as in like a different species like QB. Naked in caves. Okay, that's mean. Why are we focusing on the teachers? Oh man. I guess it's kind of nice seeing somebody else's reaction to everything that's happening. So they think Madoka knows something. She's going through a lot. Oh wait, wait, that's Madoka's mom. <laughs> I just noticed. They were friends? Nah, she can't tell you that.
I don't know, man. Uh, Madoka's kind of um, getting involved with a lot of things that she shouldn't be getting involved in. If only QB didn't show up in front of her. She could have at least brought an umbrella. What? What is this place? Where is this place? Oh man. I feel like she I feel like she needs to explain things to Madoka. Otherwise it's just gonna end up the same thing over and over again. Tell her. Okay, she probably broke down a little bit. Okay. She, she's feeling a lot, like her life sucks. Like even with her ability, her life sucks. Imagine losing her friend over and over and over and over again. Man. Gosh, this is sad. Oh, that is really sad. Can, can she travel back, like, further, or is that the only pl time she can travel back to? Okay. I hope Madoka listens. Oh, man. Whatever that W super long-worded, uh... Oh no, it's coming, it's coming. Woo! Supercell. I learned that in school. That's a big storm, I think. Okay. I wonder what it looks like. Um, we, we've been hinted of that thing since like episode one all i know is uh it's huge and it's dangerous we, we don't know like 
what what like what it looks like. Uh, she can't defeat it all over all those times. What can she do different this time? Let's see it. Oh, that's like a whole carnival. Are those like real life fabrics? Can anybody tell me where how how they get like these uh creepy witch animation? Like they they look so real sometimes. Okay, okay. Naked transformation. Okay. Talk about bazook. Okay, goddamn. One bazooka after another. Oh my god. This is like... Holy cow. How long can she stop time for? I wonder who... I wonder which magic girl this... This witch came from. Oh my gosh. Man. What's gonna happen? How are they gonna kill this thing? It looks creepy as hell. Oh, damn! What is that? A summer? Oh, a mortar? A, a missile launcher? Oh my god. There, I mean, there's no way she stole that from the military. How the hell did she carry? Oh no, she has like a storage space in her shield, doesn't she? Oh my god. Just how long did she stop time for? I don't understand. Just steal a bunch of nukes. Wouldn't that work? Sure, like, if she can, if she can jump into, uh, military bases, surely she can take nukes, right? Have she never thought about taking nukes? I feel like nukes would be a very powerful weapon. Oh, she's still gotta outrun it, though, right? Oh, shit, ah! What the hell? Okay, okay, blood is not good. Blood is not good. That's, like, the first time I've seen her get hit. I, just, just a little suggestion. Next time, if, if this time fails, she should go and get a, like, you know, a, a nuke. A lot of nukes. Because if, if bombs can blow up other witches, a nuke can probably take good damage out of this thing. No, QB, no. Walla Cooper just nicked Walla Pochi Shishiki Shineshkit. I can't say it. Why did they have to make the name so long? I think so. She probably just nicked it the time I try again. Oh yeah, I never thought about the possibility that she would become a witch. Yeah, how how did she like avoid becoming a witch? Like I'm sure this is not just like a year or two thing. I'm sure she's been like going back for at least three years already. I don't know, maybe even more than just three years, who knows?
Oh. <laughs> that was a nice slap. She needed that. Just slap her some more. Keep her there. Keep her there. I don't think she taught you how to survive against a, uh, a freaking skyscraper size uh monster that that can take bazookas and missiles and torpedoes and guns and all and all sorts of explosions and still live and, and you can do like a nationwide destruction you know if she pushed a little bit too hard i feel like madoka is probably gonna tumble down the stairs i don't think you guys care though That thing is huge. I want to know the origins of this thing. Like, why is it so powerful? Is there like a cooldown on her time stop? Because sometimes I see her like not time stop and still attack people. No. Oh. What was that? Well, what's that? She's already hurt. Bad. Yes. Ooh, that doesn't look good. I don't know. Mm. Oh no. Don't do anything stupid. Oh no, 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 no. You gotta. No, don't do this. Keep your hopes up. No! It's coming to black. Oh, no. We didn't lose her, did we? No, did Madoka become Magic Girl again? No, oh, Madoka. Why? Why? Why, Madoka? Okay, Madoka, you become a freaking magic girl again. Ah. Alright, alright, fine, fine. I, I accept the fact that you became a magic girl. It's probably unavoidable. After all, the next episode is the last episode. I hope she lives up to my expectations. I don't want this to be a lame fight. I don't want this to be like one of those animes where it gives you a shit ending and uh, where, where everything's very disappointed because I mean this show has been giving off a vibe that everything will just turn shit. I hope this this doesn't does I, I hope this show isn't one of those. I hope it ends well like like the shows I like. Oh, man, I am so hyped for the last episode. 
Hey, thank you guys for watching Love Episode 11 all the way through with me. I hope you guys enjoyed the reaction. Um, yeah, I, I, I'm very looking forward to Episode 12.